Hey guys, you here, right? Hey, you know, so yesterday in Rockstar News, why they pretty much brought a um, new article confirming a bunch of information for the PS4 Xbox One version of GTA 5, which is coming around the corner next month, 18th of November, which I'm really, really excited for. Already pre ordered a digital copy, so I'm just hoping for the download right away. So, one thing you noticed which stood out for me the most from this article is the one particular screenshot, which is this one you see now in this footage, uh, out of the bulk of screenshots they've sent in that particular article. And what you notice here is a custom race being held place on the newer version of GTA 5. You can see it's a, con it's a content created custom race. You can see the tire stacks in the background behind the black dominator near the rocky areas. And uh, on the inside of this corner, you see nice new rumble strips we've never seen before in the current version of GTA 5 for PS3 and Xbox 360. So what it seems like to me is gonna be new additions of props. One in particular you see here in this image is for land races. So it's a new land race prop, most likely. And it's absolutely awesome because the way they've done this, and you can see it's a nice thick prop. And it seems like it's all in sort of one form, which means you can use multiple uh, of these sort of designs for every corner part of your track that you're creating which only means you're gonna have more options to put other props down which obviously indicates to us there's gonna be more props added for content creator who knows maybe 100 200 maybe 300 we never know how much you know these next gen consoles gonna handle so what we know is gonna be more props new props added like lump rumble strips and what this allows is proper racing of proper apex corner which you can see the cars are actually following in the image the dominator which is in front of the black gauntlet there on apex of the corner they're not actually caught in the corner which you know we at the moment do because there's no excuse for that and pretty much uh, it's going to allow proper racing with proper racing line which is that you have to take sorry which is absolutely awesome and we should expect to see that along with 30 man racing which is also confirmed because they say that it's going to be allowed for death matches as well as racing quite evidently there from the articles as well as Jobs being transferred from, you know, current gen consoles to both next um, ne next gen consoles like PS4 and Xbox One. So that's awesome. I don't have to spend time recreating tracks anymore. All the tracks that I create on the PS3 will automatically be available for Xbox One and PlayStation 4. So you guys can try out my jobs right from there off the bat from 18th of November. So that's crazy. And that's something that I wanted for a long time. And it's awesome to see they've confirmed that. So this is pretty much me covering what I do on my channel and what relates to me and what I do in GTA 5 as you guys know is pretty much only racing. I'm sure you guys have subscribed for that as well. You guys might be interested in racing or interested in car stats maybe as I do car comparisons and whatnot. I'm certainly going to be redoing most of my car comparisons for next year in GTA 5 as a lot of things would be changed. A lot of things will be added new cars and new vehicles that we're going to be getting that they've also confirmed. From this article yesterday but the main features and the main things i wanted to sort of bring out of today's video is this new prop they're going to be adding for racing which is awesome rumble strips it's going to prevent corner contact as you know if you do cut the rumble strips traction is decreased most likely will cause you to spin out which is absolutely awesome so proper racing guys expect to see that for next gen gta 5 i'm going to be playing on the ps4 let me know if you guys are going to be getting gta 5 on the ps4 or the xbox one in the comments down below and let me know your thoughts about this brand new information that just came out yesterday for the next new version of gta 5 thanks for watching guys i'll see you guys soon show you soon now good night peace yeah right guys first of all this was taken straight from the live stream yesterday i was i was doing a little walk through this first few missions came up and we didn't realize it was completely bugged out i wasted 